Hello and welcome to another edition of Sports Update Ghana. Coming up in this edition, we're going to look at six players who have been handed call up by coach Chris Hutton in Ghana's squad for the doubleheader against Angola in the 2023 AFCON qualifiers. These players happen to be usual faces in the Black Stars but were left out of Ghana's 2022 FIFA World Cup squad. But surprisingly, one new player has been handed a call up and we're going to check out all on him as well as how these players have been performing at their various clubs. More coming up shortly, but first, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't, like, share, and don't forget to leave a comment. Let's start off with Patrick Puzo. Yes, Patrick Puzo is 25 years old and was born in Accra, Ghana. Patrick Puzo plays as a left back and adds up to Gideon Mensa in the squad. The left back position of the Black Stars has been one of the greatest concerns to many as Ghana has had to rely on Barbara Mann who many believe that he's not industrious enough to handle the left back position for the Black Stars. Hence the decision for Chris Hutton to bring on Patrick Pozo who plays for Sheriff Tiraspol in the Bordeauxven League. This season, Patrick Pozo has been very instrumental for Sheriff Tiraspol in the European competitions. He's played three games in the Europa Conference League as well as seven games in the Superliga and played all six games in the Europa League group stages. He also played in the Europa League qualifying matches as well as the UEFA Champions League qualifying matches for FC Sheriff Tiraspol. He has made a total of 25 appearances for FC Sheriff Tiraspol this season in Europe and has made 1,966 minutes under his sleeves. Well, in the Europa League where he came up against Manchester United, Patrick Pozo was able to put up one of the best performances so far as a player for FC Sheriff Tiraspol. He gave Anthony a very tough time at the left-hand flanks of the pitch. But Patrick Pozo does not only play as a left-back, he can also be used as a winger on the left-hand flanks. Well, Patrick Pozo was named in Ghana's squad for the 2022 FIFA World Cup provisional squad, but when the squad was reduced to the 26-man squad, the young man was omitted by coach Otuado, who was previously the head coach of the Black Stars. Patrick Pozo in the past has played for Ghana's under-20 side and has made two appearances for them, but at age 25, he is now yet to play for the Black Stars as he has been named in Ghana's squad for the doubleheader against Angola. The next player we have here is Edmond Addo. Edmond Addo is just 22 years of age and was born in Choco, Accra. He plays as a defensive midfielder and has been playing for the Black Stars since the year 2021 when he was handed his call up to the national team. Edmond Addo currently plays for Spartak in the Serbian league since moving from Sheriff Tiraspol where he played for them last season. This season though, the Ghanaian defensive midfielder has been able to play just six matches since joining them at the start of the January transfer window. Well, the Ghanaian defensive midfielder has played the entire 90 minutes in his last six matches as he has been impressive for his club in the Superliga in the Serbian League. For Edmond Addo, he has made eight appearances for the Black Stars since 2021 when he first made his appearance for the Black Stars. He was part of Ghana's squad at the 2021 AFCON in Cameroon where Ghana exited at the group stages. He was part of Ghana's squad that helped the country qualify for the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar. Unfortunately, when he came to the 2022 FIFA World Cup squad, he was left out of the squad by coach Otto Addo. But now he has been handed the lifeline by coach Chris Hutton and I think that his good relationship with Chris Hutton is what has made him end a call up to the Black Stars once again. The next player we have here is Ransford Dubois Connex Dofa, one of the skillful players we have in the Black Stars. But this young man was left out of Ghana's squad for the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Ransford Dubois Connex Dofa is just 21 years of age as he was born on September 13, 2001. He was born in Berlin in Germany but switched nationalities from Germany to play for the Black Stars in the year 2022. For Ransford Yeboa Connex Dofa, he made three appearances for the German youth side before switching nationalities to play for the Black Stars and since joining the Black Stars, he's made only one appearance for the Black Stars and that was in Ghana's friendly match against Brazil. 
Well, this season, as he plays for Hamburger in the Bundesliga 2 in Germany, the young man has been able to score 9 incredible goals for his side in 23 appearances. Well, recently, he was able to score one goal in their last match and before that, he scored another goal. So, in his last two games, the young man has been very, very instrumental in scoring two consecutive goals in their games. Well, for Ransford Ibuwa Konexdofa, he's a versatile player who can play at the right back and also play as an attacking midfielder, left winger and also as a centre back and can be used as a striker as well so the player can be used in five different positions and that is how he has been able to play for his club Hamburger SV in the Bundesliga 2 he is very versatile when it comes to playing with the ball and all that he is very good with assist as well and I hope that this time coach Chris Hutton will give him more playing time at the Black Stars now the fourth player we have here is Jojo Wolakot Jojo Wolakot was the goalkeeper that helped Ghana qualify for the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar. Unfortunately, days to the start of the 2022 FIFA World Cup tournament, Jojo Wolakot got injured and had to be omitted from Ghana's squad for the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It was very heartbreaking as the young man who qualified Ghana for the World Cup was not available when it mattered most. Well, Jojo Wolakot is just 26 years of age and has more playing time ahead and could play for the Black Stars in the World Cup at the next tournament. But this time he has been handed a call-up for Ghana's game against Angola. After he got injured and returned to action, Jojo Wolakot has never been in action for his club this season. He has been on the bench throughout since returning from injury, but coach Chris Hutton trusts him enough to include him in his squad for Ghana's games against Angola. Well, when it comes to the Black Stars, Jojo Wolakot has played 11 matches and out of that 11 matches, he has two clean sheets and has helped the Black Stars win four matches and lost four matches. And that is the record of Jojo Wolakot, who currently plays for Charlton Athletic in the English League One. So the next player we have here is Majid Ashimeru. Majid Ashimeru is 25 years old and plays for RS Anderlecht in the Belgian league. Majid Ashmeru this season has been very instrumental for his club having played a number of matches. He has only played two games for the Black Stars interestingly since making his debut in the year 2017. His last match for the Black Stars in, was in Ghana's AFCON qualifiers against South Africa back in 2021. Since then, Majid Ashmeru has never been called to the Black Stars. Well, many Ghanaians have since been calling for his call-up to the Black Stars as he was left out in Coach Otuado's squad for the 2022 FIFA World Cup. This season, at club level, Majid Ashmeru has played a total of 32 games for his club RSC Anderlecht and has a goal contribution of 5 which has seen him score 2 goals and has three assists so far with Anderlecht. Majid Ashimeru, when it comes to his position on the pitch, can play versatile as a central midfielder as well as a defensive midfielder and an attacking midfielder. This season in the league though, the Ghanaian player has been able to play a number of matches which includes playing 23 games so far in the Belgian Pro League coming on as a substitute in 17 out of his 23 appearances for his club this season. So that is about Majid Ashimeru who is making a return to the Black Stars after nearly two years away from the national team. Last but not the least is Joseph Pencil. Yes, the players that many called for his inclusion for the 2022 FIFA World Cup, but unfortunately, Coach Otuadu left him out of his squad for the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar. The 25 year old Ghanaian winger plays for KRC Genk in the Belgian Julipa Pro League. This season, Joseph Pencil has played 27 matches and has scored 12 goals and has 12 assists, giving him 24 goal contributions in 27 matches in total for his club KRC Genk in the Belgian Julipa Pro League. Joseph Pencil can play on the right hand wings as well as the left hand wings. Interestingly, since making his debut for the Black Stars on May 25th, 2027, the Ghanaian has only played six matches within Expand 
of five years. His first game for the Black Stars was a game that many do not remember, but he was very instrumental for the Black Stars at the 2021 AFCON as he played three games for the Black Stars. He was also part of Ghana's squad that qualified for the World Cup in Qatar, having played the playoffs against Nigeria. But when it came to the most important tournament, which was the World Cup, Joseph Pento was surprising left out of the squad and it was quite disappointed that we couldn't have the mercurial winger in Ghana squad for the World Cup. But guess what? Coach Chris Hutton has been able to call him back to the Black Stars and we hope that with his inclusion in the Black Stars this time, he will be able to stay longer to witness the World Cup with the Black Stars next time when it is held. Well, these are the six players who have been named in Ghana squad for the doubleheader against Angola. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, share and don't forget to leave a comment. See you in the next one.